On the outside, it's business as usual at Bank of America along Park Avenue. But for an ATM technician, last night was far from that. I'm just got so many different words I want to say. What was supposed to be a quick repair at one of the ATMs behind me turned into five minutes of horror when a technician heard a strange voice behind him confirming one of his deepest fears. I hear a voice behind me saying, don't make any sudden moves. Too shaken to talk on camera, we spoke with the man by phone. He says at the time he was updating the ATM software when he was approached by an unknown man. As I looked him over for a second, I realized he's pointing a gun at me. And uh, that's when my heart fell in my stomach. And I'm just thinking, man, you just need to comply. The robber demanded all of the cash from the ATM, which is believed to be more than $100,000. Typically, the employee would have had a guard with him, but he opted not to. For me to call a guard and wait for an hour for him to show up, then for me to get my job done another half hour later, it just seems like such a waste of time whenever I can get it out. It's now a decision that he regrets, but also he feels fortunate to be alive after such a close call. I really should have called a guard, but, you know, that's hindsight thinking, and that just keeps repeating in my mind over and over and over. Reporting in East Memphis, Jordan James, WREG. News Channel 3. A lesson learned. We reached out to Bank of America for comment, but have not heard back. Regarding the investigation, police say they are still searching for a suspect. If you know anything, call Crime Stoppers at 901-528-CASH.